Hello, welcome to Morning Devotion. What come out of our mouth can tear down or build us up. We can see an example with uh, the Israelite and Gideon in the book of Judges chapter 6. So there came a time when the Israelites were suffering because of their disobedience to uh, God's instruction. So they were praying to God and God sent a prophet. And when the prophet came, the prophet went over uh, everything they failed to do. And at the end, from verse 8 to 10, in verse 10, he told them, you wouldn't listen. You guys wouldn't listen to the instructions of God. Well, the Israelites already knew their suffering. And they were looking for ways to get out of it. The prophet came, just emphasized on what they failed to do. This is not really encouraging for me. But uh, then God sent an angel uh, to Gideon. So when the angels came, the way he uh, addressed Gideon was particular. We can read it quickly in Judges chapter 6 from verse 12 to 14. It says, When the angel of the Lord appeared to Gideon, he said, The Lord is with you, mighty warrior. This right here is really encouraging for somebody that was not thinking highly about himself to be called a mighty warrior. So Gideon has all had all the reason to uh, be discouraged, but just by calling him mighty warrior got him thinking, why do you call me mighty warrior? If I am, so why are we suffering? So Gideon himself tried to talk himself down, but the angel went on and on reminding him that the Lord is with him. So in verse 14, the Lord turned to him and said, go in the strength you have and save Israel out of the Midian's hand. Am I not sending you? And Gideon tried to uh, dissuade the angel, but the angel also caught with his word encouraged Gideon. And at the end, the words of the angel uh, build back up faith in Gideon and he was able to go and deliver Israel out of Midian's hand. For you and I today, whatever we say, the way we talk or what people say about us or to us can tear us down or build us up, give us new hope, strength, build up our faith. So our encouragement this morning is for us to watch what we say to others and what we say to ourselves. If you are listening to me today and you don't have any idea of what I'm talking about, faith, it all starts by accepting Jesus as your Lord and Savior, as our Lord and Savior. And then you will have a good understanding of what faith is. So I invite you this morning to give your life to Jesus, to receive him as your Lord and Savior, and he will build up your faith. And through his word, you will be able to encourage yourself, to encourage others in the name of Jesus. Have a blessed day. Amen.